No, I knew it was going to happen. Then, yes. I have these causes and these people that are present. I wasn't going to lie. It's as if a blade of grass got conscious. No matter what you're going through, he didn't forget about you. He loves you. Three questions, Casey Lynch. The first question is, who's the first person that believed in you? My pops, you know, him kind of being a rebel to the cause too growing up. As much as he didn't want me to fall into his like footsteps per se, he still understood the value of like, Letting my son be my son, be, be himself, you know what I'm saying? So he really put the battery in my back at an early age, bro. Like, just was like, yo, this is what you want to do. Really do it, you know what I'm saying? Don't take it for granted, you know, and stay blessed and like, you know, stay prayed up every day. Pasta Oucha, you love me when I chain smoke bogeys and stole from wallets. My next door neighbor gives 60 Send the wages to Niger. Memorize the book of Revelations and recites it loudly. Kids hydro playing for a local name and get lawless outcomes. In my childhood, rock more fake air forces than real ones. You love me when New York don't love me was a local anthem. You love me when I missed out on sixteen thousand dollars in February and had you cover most of the rent. Astounding soul survivors, globe trotters, pope power, protected from these cowards on earth for another hundred years. That we so out it. That's the one. Meditated and really like accepted where I was at in my life, being a new father, being in a new city, and kind of what my relationship is to the changing of your environment. Kobe with the Jesus 33, Lower Marion. Oyster perpetual wrist watches, magnet. The evolution must continue to know it challenges. The residue of the discontinue living through atomists. Kick that Mayan hieroglyphic shit A project window hypnotist Let the sun roof down for photosynthesis From hamsters on the peloton To now propeller hopping I wasn't born this popping I had to get it popping Raising daughters my And I don't see myself doing this like really forever But being creative is something I see myself doing No matter what so I think It's kind of hard to say it's an end game Because I feel like the goal is to kind of create something that has like Substantial longevity and I don't even know what that looks like. Is it like more stores? Is it more accounts? Is it more of this, more of that? I don't know. But I think it's more like... To be honest, I haven't thought about that yet I still feel like I'm still, I'm still new to this in a weird way. And I've been at it for a long time. So I not really think about it, but when it comes to like effect and like things I really want to do, I'm like, I still got so much more on the, uh, on the horizon, you know? So I'm like, you know what? And for me, like the cover, that's an homage to David Hammonds and the way he worked was with his body and this was my version. You know, he, that address is his studio, but I'm posed in front of like where I live. And that's my studio, you know, that's where I'm making these things. No, I knew it was going to happen. You did? Yes. I wouldn't have drawn it if, it, if I didn't. Char boil bodies, gargoyles. Too often I peep proximity, spoil and birth laziness. Too often I've been judged by who I don't put on in my radius. Too often I get asked about favors and not how my baby is. Too often. Too often a dollar of mine in my account's been assumed. Direct revelation strikes, sitting for hours by the pool. PA work in Hollywood Hills, digesting my will as a male. Too often. Start a Patreon for these nuances Staff writers react quick Fans rush to the famous feature On the track list No one makes it to the outro Where the fact lives Too often, too often Fold the laundry in the middle of a civil war Living up to no humans not pure But they spirits pure Pick sticks out my afro at the grocery store Complex just cover me I'm close to asking for a job Too often, too often I bitched about lack of applause Confusion redirects my temple and this is demigods All of those idols I put on pedestals now dissolve All of those rivals I made in a bedroom Thank God I ain't hit it raw I was a piece of shit Selfish and concentrated Consistently changing I fucked with you And then I fucked your cousin One week apart The trials and tribulations of self-inflation Tainting a sauce oh. 
soul philosopher, distro barometer, lymph nodes, solvity, sick flows, remodeling. Sheesh. Be quiet while I'm pondering. All those times my pops wasn't proud of me, I was conquering. A family tree of failed musicians, I've decided to reprise or root the dead root so we can grow with some pride. The closest one, the real success from my whole mother's side. We don't talk much, but those distant prayers sanctify. My auntie comment buzz my Facebook with affirmations. Everyone thinking I've made it means I'm closer to making it very often. I feel like it touched my spirit, not my body, you know what I mean? This is definitely my favorite project that I've heard from Radimus. He said that this is the first project that he made um, after his daughter was born, and you can really feel it, you can tell. It's like a different type of passion, a different type of hunger, a different type of love that went into this project. Uh, connect with that journey, you know, coming from New York, going into LA for the first time. Finding other forms of inspiration separate to my own medium has, has given me a lot of joy and, and, and has been the healthiest thing for me, I think, recently. So, this shit was really good, though. The beat, Spingle was flowing on it. You know I'm about to be listening to this album, just like, you know, sipping some coffee. It's coffee, you feel me? How we combine different things uh, through, through history and make something new. You know, um, life was cyclical, and I think we're entering a new phase in, in art, and the people who are looking to combine these different aspects are the people who are going to move ahead. I felt like I already listened to it before. Like, I was so sure it was going to be fire when I walked in, and that's exactly what happened. So. Like, there's a reason. Like he said, he doesn't like to do things just for being productive. It's like, I want to make sure everything I'm doing has a reason. That's what Brad, Casey, and I all met in the same shop working in New York. And for us to now all be in Los Angeles, all doing our own thing, but to be able to align alongside Leon uh, from Play and his team, this feels really, really special. I think this gives everyone something to look forward to. Um, this is very much the beginning of our journey, journey here in the city. 